folks, today I'm going to be telling you about the worst tenant I have ever had in my life. A junkie that trashed my house, did drugs in my house, turned my house into a whorehouse, did basically everything possibly bad you can imagine, trashed two of my fucking hot water heaters, broke a furnace, clogged my sanitation line multiple times from flushing repeatedly shit down the toilet on purpose to clog my lines and leaving meth and needles out in my driveway and yard and trying to put screws under my tires to pop my tires stealing from me literally stealing from like every problem you could think of having i've had with this girl so this is really just going to be like a photo dump of everything i've had to deal with in the eight months that she was squatting at my property. And I'm really just putting this all on a video so I can delete all this finally and clear up some storage and just put her in the past and forget she ever existed and ever ruined my life in the first place. So yeah, that's really what this is gonna be. So enjoy seeing uh, my sadness. <laughs> Well, boys, on today's episode, they broke my door, and they broke their little crack camera off, but other than that, it's been going good, I guess. Not only does my lovely tenant spray paint on the house and the ground, she rips her mail up and leaves it out here. That's what else she does. Yeah, this is, you know, standard stuff she said. Regular wear and tear. That's what she called it. LOL. Fuck with it. Oh, I'm gonna play nice until I don't play nice anymore, and then. Um... Hey, you guys really can't park there. I'm parking here. You don't own the I fucking do. I'm calling them right now. Yeah. So if you listen. That's cranking full blast. That is wide open. How high are they up there? I don't know if anyone recognizes this bike, but if your bike was stolen and looks like this, it's over here at my house on North Colorado Ave. And my tenant stole it, so. The tomatoes or eggs would have been a good call. We got all the cats. No way. She got all the cats. <laughs> For the streets. Yo. Wait, one, two, three. Oh, yeah, that big carry. Uh -huh. When she comes down with the big carry, go to town. Word. Mm -hmm. Do 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 do. Scooby dooby dooby. <laughs> Meow. Her, sis. All right, so there's John. Thanks, John, again for your help today. Here's the pile that me and me and Jay, John got a lot of joy out of today. I think he relieved some much-needed anger and frustration and stress. 
This is that fucking pile that we just hogged out of this bitch's crib. Oh, look, 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 wait, 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 wait. Not even the best part. We got some needles right there. Here's the meth we found in the oh. arcade. There's rubbers because, you know, she also ran a whorehouse up there. And uh, her vibrator's going off in here. Yeah, listen. Yeah, listen to her. But anyways, so I'll show you upstairs how that looks. So, yeah, that was pretty much those last clips were from her eviction uh, a few weeks ago. And, yeah, that's, that's pretty much it. That's going to end this video on this magnificent tenant. Um, she was definitely a breadwinner, as you can see. One of the better ones for sure. <laughs> and, uh, yeah. I don't know. It's gonna end this. I don't really got much left to say. I'm kind of just still in disbelief that she's finally gone because I never thought I was gonna get her out and it was just a never ending nightmare for so long. So happy to say this is finally the end. For good boys. She said she was gonna kill me, but I don't think she's gonna come near me and like in a month I'll be strapped. So if she does, I'll kill her. See ya.